Hey guys, just gonna make a quick little video here of this uh, resonator board I resurrected out of an old sick polymoog board. Um, actually, I'm just testing it right now inside my polymoog. Um, basically, what I did, I fixed it up for synthesizers.com, which you can see I made the connector here. But what I found out is the power supply is very noisy, so I'm going to add some filter caps. It just had so much hysteresis going on, parasitic hysteresis. So I just slapped the polymoke jack back on just to see if it was something related to power, and sure enough it was. Um, I'm just going to show you what this thing sounds like. I'm running the Moog Rogue through the resonator. Now I've just got it powered just using the polymoke supply for power. Um, but anyways, what I did, I built it with the gain knob, which is the same control you see over here on the polymoke. So I got the resonator master gain control. And then these are basically the same thing you see here, just in knob form, with a really bad, poorly laid out uh, interface right now. But uh, I'll just kind of show what this sounds like. We'll start with the low, low section. As you can hear, here's your mid. It's got a problem. I'm still working on the bugs in it. But it's got a bad connection somewhere. Let's try and get it. To... Come on. We got different uh, passes. Right now I'm in band pass. I'll try to do this one handed. It's kind of a hard switch. It's just a rotary switch. As low. Twist to turn. It's really tough doing this one handed and no knobs. There we go. That's band pass. You can adjust your gains to offset the uh, balance between them. Get the low end. Your emphasis and your control frequency. It's just like what you see here with low control frequency emphasis and gain. Same same basic principle. Get it to go to high. 
top band here. Top pass, I mean. There we go. Anyways, that's just a look at this. You can add some filtering here too. A lot of variations in this little circuit. Very nice. But anyways, I just want to make a quick video. Now, this is actually uh, for one of my friends, Voltar. Uh, who's on uh, Facebook and YouTube. Uh, this, he sent me this polymog board. I cut it down. I'll just kind of show what it looks like here. I'm going to show everything off. But basically what I did is I took one of these boards here that has your fixed filters. It has the resonator circuit. And what I did, I just hacked it down. And uh, pull my stuff here. It's not really the... This is what you call troubleshooting and building and trying out and testing and prototyping and you can kind of see how this looks. Basically I took and bought the pots and you can kind of see here I got them labeled behind too. Um, but basically I took the board, hacked it down, added needed components. You can see the capacitor and stuff there which is, is found on the VCF board part of the output circuit. Um, it already had the input circuit because you actually have on the polymog you have a uh, external input for the resonator section or the VCF so you can actually do things within the polymog as well um, but this is just focusing just on the resonator um, but yeah you can see I kind of cut things down I use parts of the circuit locations of the fixed filter boards to add the components needed to make it work and I uh, got all that fixed up uh, really it's this really cool little board um, but what I got to do now is I got to figure out how to get the noise down because whenever you hook it up to a synthesizers.com or whatever, it's just so noisy that you get parasitic uh, hysteresis in your in your actual voltages, and it causes this thing to pick up radio stations and scream and oscillate and all kind of nasty stuff. But uh, there's actually going to be a nicer panel here. That, uh, uh, the guy that actually owns this one's going to make us his own panel. So I just kind of did this, just a uh, mock-up, just to kind of give a layout idea. And I put this on its own harness so it can be located somewhere else if if, if he wants it. But uh, So basically what you got, you got your master gain, which is found over here. If you're probably moving your resonator section here. You got your low, medium, and high, just like you found the polymog. I eliminated all the circuitry related to the splits and the in the on-off function, so you don't have to worry about any of that. And uh, so yeah, so it's a it's a real nice little module. And once I get it all finished, it'll be be able to be plugged into a dot com and and work hopefully very well. But uh, anyways, just want to make a quick little video of this. Take care.